Well, you know, uh, during this segment that we feature different design across Michiana, we enjoy going into homes that have had a facelift. And here with us is Kevin Hostetler of Lock Construction. And Kevin, this is a home that we've kind of tracked for the last, oh, maybe two months or so. A beautiful home, no question about it, that after about 10 years, uh, the homeowner decided to do more than just a facelift, but really do some significant remodeling. And we're right now at the very finishing stage of this home. And uh, it has to be quite rewarding for you and lot construction. It just looks beautiful. It really does. It really does. Everything has come together well. Um, it's always enjoyable when you see, when you take something from step one where you're taking things apart and, and in essence making it um, look kind of nasty for a while with all the dirt and the dust and things. Um, but you, you, you clean all that up and you start putting pieces back together. It's really rewarding to see it all come together. And, you know, just being here and watching the painters put a few final touches on is just, it's exciting. It really is. Virtually every room of this home has been touched by lock construction. Kevin, we were in the kitchen not long ago. What a wonderful job. Air cabinets in there. And you have the different appliances that are just the you know, state of the art. Uh, the bathrooms, uh, the, is it the his and hers bathroom we looked at not long ago and the new look to the shower, the flooring is all new. And of course, what's happening now is the finishing trim work, the painting of the trim by Premier Painting. And this really sets it off. Uh, the different color schemes in here really make this project pretty special. Yeah, you're right. I mean, you can do a lot of nice cabinets, a lot of nice floor covering, but if your colors don't make those, um, uh, do, doesn't pull from that, doesn't make it pop, it can really make or break your project. And I think that's why it's very important to hire the right interior decorator and the right painter um, to apply those products for you because they can help you walk through um, those steps necessary to come to that point. Mm -hmm. It'd be kind of sad, wouldn't it? I mean, if you've done all the work, you've been here for a couple of months, and then the paint uh, just didn't happen for you. That would be a disaster. That's correct. That's correct. I mean, really, that does make or break your project. Well, one of the guys working over here is a friend of yours. Tell us a little bit about Steve, can you? Uh, Steve Bruick, we go to church together. Just a really great guy. Um, does an excellent job. That's prob probably primarily the reason we use him is just um, we, we enjoy his uh, charisma and his positive attitude, how well he works with us, and ultimately the job that he does for us on our projects. Well, at Lot Construction, their motto is you'll love what they build for you. It's not you'll kind of like what we build for you. It's love, and love is a power, powerful word, isn't it? That's correct. It is. And I think Steve loves what he's doing as he works with Lot. Steve, how you doing? Real good, Craig. Good to see you. Yeah. Thank you. And Steve, you know, when we were talking before coming on here with you just briefly, you told me that you really do enjoy painting. You're not just saying that, right? I really do. I've been doing it over 20 years now, and I couldn't get up and do anything else every morning. I've thought a lot of times, what could I change and do as a different profession? And there's really nothing else I would enjoy as much. Excellent, excellent. Well, there's a lot of us at home that have probably attempted doing some painting. And I told you, I was honest. I told Steve, I said, you know, I just hate painting. I don't like it. And there's probably a few of you out there that can relate to that. But why not go with someone who really likes what they're doing, loves what they're doing, and does a great job? Now, I don't see any tape here. You're not taping off like I would do at home. It seems like half of the work is just the taping. The painting is the fun part, but you don't do much taping around here. Why is that? Um, I'm blessed to have a great crew. I really do guys and uh, a lady that works for me and I'm very careful in who we get, make sure that they are oriented toward custom painting. And uh, when we come in and do it, we want it to look like something that a homeowner could not do themselves. Mm -hmm. And so that's what we gear towards. We want them 100% satisfied when we walk out the door. And that's our goal. We don't do a whole lot of advertising. We uh, try to advertise by word of mouth. That's the best way to advertise, isn't it? Yes, it is. Well, Steve, if someone is interested in contacting you, maybe through Lock Construction, of course, you guys work together quite closely. How would they get in touch with you, Steve? Uh, they could call me at my business. That's 574-784-8294. Or uh, they could send an email at premierpainting at juno.com. Sounds good. Thanks so much, Steve. Thank you. It's been a pleasure knowing you. Well, likewise, and we'll let you get back to work there. Uh, you missed a spot there, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Kevin, he really does a nice job, and uh, it's great that you're able to work with a crew, and probably makes a lot of sense, doesn't it, to work with 
pretty much the same crew on every job as much as you can. That's very important. Um, one of the keys is you you really learn um, you really learn how to communicate with each other, what works best, uh, scheduling wise. Um, it's just uh, it's just better rather than bouncing around and, and get, having six different you know people you're trying to work with and coordinate. Everyone is unique. Everyone does um, different style, maybe different quality, um, or communicates differently. Mm -hmm. So if you can link up with the same people every time, that's very, very important. You'll love what they'll build for you. That's the motto at Lock Construction. And we want to thank Steve Bruick and, of course, our friend Kevin Hostetler from Lock Construction. Listen, if you need any help at all, go to our website or go to that Lock Construction website. It's on the screen, and we'll be back in just a little bit, so stay tuned.